Hello, what's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I actually have made some soap brows. I make my own soap brows. I've DIY'd them basically. Probably a couple years back, there has been this trend where people use clear soap as like their brow setter sort of product. And since then, there actually has been a lot of people making them and selling them. They call them soap brows and basically brow setter and they are literally just soap to be honest. I have checked the ingredients and I've checked like how to make them as well. It's literally just soap. I mean obviously it came from soap basically. As long as it is a clear soap, you can use it as a soap brow. I have been looking for a good brow setter. The last that I've tried that is really amazing brow setter is the benefit brow boy or something like that it's like it's in a mascara tube kind of thing and the packaging is small and it's just perfect and that brow freaking gel actually sets the brows really 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 well like it's amazing something that sets the brow like making sure that it sets in place and then it doesn't move anymore when i see people using the soap technique but you know what just why not try it remember i actually have this like really big block chunk of soap basically just this pure block of soap i uh, melted some and put it into pots so that's easier to kind of use i guess preferably if you have like rectangular pots that would be better one set of it i added essential oil the other one is literally just pure soap the dotted ones i believe are the scented ones and the non-dotted ones are the fragrant less one or scentless one there's no essential oil in there the whole process is very simple just chop up the block chunks into smaller pieces put it over the stove in very with very very low heat just melt the soap basically don't boil them now before pouring into container it would be ideal for you to use a alcohol spray or isopropyl alcohol just to spray over the container and also on the soap itself just to remove any bubbles so that it looks clearer also when you melt down the soap as well try not to stir it because that's where it creates all the bubbles if you're trying to sell this then you want it to look clear of course but because <laughs> mine looks also like cloudy and bubbly it's because i i didn't i don't really care and i don't have this i forgot to bring out that spray my alcohol spray to spray them so that it, it looks not so bubbly doesn't really matter i'm not selling these anyway i'm just using it for my own once you pour it into the container also just spray them with alcohol just to remove all the excess bubble on top and then just let let it dry and let it harden if you want to add essential oils all you're going to do is just melt it of course and then let the melted soap cool down a little bit and then that's where you add your essential oil in there and then you quickly pour into your container okay this soap really dries really really quickly so you gotta work very very fast both out the essential oil one and the scentless one how you use a soap brow product is that you're supposed to spray 
the spoolie brush with water nothing fancy you don't have to use any thermal water or any sort of chemical solution spray the spoolie brush with water and then use the spoolie brush to pick up some of the soap and then that's where you kind of brush it all over your brows and basically style your brows okay like wax and then just let it dry and when it dries it doesn't dry very hard it actually sticks quite well it helps your brow to kind of stay in place quite well for a little while and it still feels quite soft it still feels quite natural it doesn't look like it's hardening up or make it looks like it's glued up or something like that so it still looks very natural long lasting not quite i feel like it's not very very long lasting at all i think after a couple of hours my hair just kind of go crazy again like it start drooping some of my hair start drooping out of place i think it's just a good temporary solution if you can't find any good brow gel out there that's just in my opinion i'm sure other people probably do it better than me i don't know but in my opinion for my type of like bushy brows and those brows that's quite stubborn type it just doesn't last long on my brows basically that's the result okay that's pretty much it for this video thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed i hope you learned something i will definitely see you continue using this until i found my perfect brow gel this is definitely better than any other brow gel that i have used other than the benefit one yeah until i find one i will still use this for sure because better this than nothing I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Don't forget to like and subscribe!